Hi there, this is Jeremy from the Fusion team, and here I wanted to show how you can insert a custom title block into the drawings workspace. Here I have a drawing that's in the ASME drawing standard, so it has the default ASME title block in the bottom right. And if I double click that title block, I can then populate its contents in the dialog box here. But I'm going to replace that title block, as well as the prompts you see here in the dialog box, with a title block that I created in AutoCAD. So now I'm in the AutoCAD model space, and as you can see, I have this title block here. It has some basic 2D geometry, some text, an image that I brought in, and some attributes that I defined. Those attributes will be the text that shows up in the title block dialog box in the drawings workspace when you want to populate those fields. Uh, I think I'll, I'll create one real quickly for this sheet size part of my title block. So if I type at def, to create an attribute definition. I'll give it a tag, which is the sort of the placeholder text that will show up here in, in AutoCAD. And the prompt is the text that shows up in, in the Fusion dialog box. And the default field is optional, but I'll, I can fill that in if I want to. The units and scale are converted into Fusion drawings at a 1 to 1 ratio from AutoCAD using whatever the insertion units are set to here in AutoCAD. So I have the insertion unit set to millimeter and this title block, since it's 170 millimeters across, when I bring it into Fusion, it's going to be 170 millimeters across on that page, regardless of what my units are set to in Fusion. Uh, and one other thing I wanted to note is the UCS origin, this 0, 0 point will convert to the bottom right corner in the Fusion Drawings workspace. So I have my title block set up like this, where the UCS origin point is at the bottom right. So that way when I bring this title block into the Fusion workspace, I won't have to move it around to have it in the right spot. So I'm going to save this DWG. And then if I go back into the Fusion Drawings workspace, I can click Insert Title Block down here under Sheet Settings. And if I select that title block I just created, you'll see that it replaces that default ASME title block on the screen. And just like that default title block, if I double click it, any attributes that I created show up here. So that's it, a very basic overview of how you can bring in your own DWG file into Fusion Drawings and use it as a title block. Thanks for watching.